Good day, fine folk of GameSpot, and welcome to Start Select. Coming up on today's gut-wrenchingly exciting show... EA denies Turn 10 Porsches in Forza 4, and Skyrim's hot gay action. Fresh from establishing itself as a plucky underdog in the fight between Battlefield and Call of Duty, Electronic Arts has demonstrated its evil megalomaniac side by denying Forza the Porsche cars it wants so very, very much. EA holds the license to use the German manufacturer's cars in video game form and was only too happy to let Turn 10 use 35 different Porsches in Forza 3. However, jump forward to Forza 4 and it's pulled out the Porsche banhammer and smashed the developer over the head with it. Turn 10 took to its blog to explain the situation to stricken fans. For Forza 4, we were looking forward to adding even more Porsche cars and we were especially looking forward to featuring multiple Porsche experiences in our new Auto Vista mode. In the end, however, EA couldn't see the way towards collaborating again, said community rep Brian Eckberg, crying into his new wireless speed wheel. EA, meanwhile, will keep Porsche exclusively for its upcoming arcade racer, Need for Speed The Rum. Skyrim has long been one of the most popular games on GameSpot, undoubtedly because people have been desperate to find out the answer to one simple question. Will there be same-sex marriages in the game? Well, rest assured friends, you can get it on with anyone you like in the upcoming role-playing game, as Bethesda's Pete Hines has confirmed on his Twitter feed. He said, you can marry anyone, not any NPC, just any male or female, doesn't matter what you're playing. However, not everyone's happy about this. In a five-page forum on GameSpot on the topic, user Cloaked Bolts moaned, they accept gay marriage, but they don't accept the spear. The time they take to develop gay marriage, which totally doesn't fit the genre or that similar time period, could have been contributed to the spears. But we can't help but agree with user BlackMantis512, who says, this game is going to be fabulous. Right, that's it from me for today's Start Select, but for more Skyrim, check out Super Start Select tomorrow, where we'll have an interview with the aforementioned Pete Hines. Tatty bye!